Hey guys, welcome to Book Club. This episode is the first community poll and now by the end of this video you'll have all the information that you need to participate in the polls and how you need to comment and then vote later and I'll explain everything that you need to know, all of the books that are available for you to choose from to bring to the live reads and I'm really excited to interact with all of you guys about what books are the most popular of the moment and they're the ones that I'll be bringing to the live reads. So let's go. So yeah, hey guys, I've been speaking about this on the live reads and in some of the videos for a little while now, and now is the time where I finally bring it to the channel, the community poll where you need to comment and then vote later on when I put the poll up on the book club. But I've shared two videos previously, one on Roald Dahl's Books of Recommendation from Matilda and another one, Books of Introduction to Spirituality. But if you want a bigger pool of books, all of these books are available and are within the pool that you can pick for the live read. But if you want more and if there's one that jumped out of you from Roald Dahl's recommendations from Matilda, then they are in the pool as well. So every one I talk about in this video and these two other videos are available. And what I need you to do is to just comment. Comment which one you would most like to see come to the live reads in the comments on this video. The books with the most comments will go on to the poll and then the polls work like any other poll. You vote the ones with the most votes are the ones that I'm going to read. So yeah, really excited about this to bring the books that are most popular at the moment. And yeah, let's see how we go. Eh? I'm sure it will adapt and morph over time. But ultimately, what I really need you to do is to comment what book you would most like to see me read on the live reads. And then obviously, when I get enough comments, I'll put them into a poll. And then we'll look into um, you guys voting for what one you'd like best. And just before I begin sharing all of these titles with you, please share this around. If you know others who would be interested in joining us for the live reads and having a book that they want to be read, read on the channel. So now I'm going to share with you all of these books that are available in the pool. And what you need to do is comment and let me know what one you want to see come to the live reads. So what I'm going to do right now is share all of these books that I have behind me that are all available for the live read. But before that, let me just give you a sneak peek. I'd definitely like to speak about a bookshelf tour. These are all of my philosophy and platonic books. And then below we have some more classic philosophy. And here we have... I would have shared these, um, my Srimad Bhagavatam volume and my Bhakti Yoga. Down here we have some more philosophy. Let me move my chair. These are all of Aldous Huxley's publications. Any of these you're interested in, let me know. And then here's George Orwell and H.G. Wells. So lots of books to choose from, but these are the main ones I want to focus on. The ones that I've mentioned previously in the books of introduction to spirituality, I won't speak too much about. I'll just um, mention them and move on. And just before we start, I did a video recently here, so I may as well start with these. We've got The Hardy Boys, The Tower Treasure, Fahrenheit 451, and all of Enid Blyton's The... Um, Enchanted Wood and a Magic Faraway Tree Collection. So these are all available. These first three, Herman Hesse's Siddhartha, The Journey of Souls and The Power of Now. I've spoken about at length in the books of Introduction to Spirituality. So if you're interested in any of these three, be sure to comment. And if you want to know more about them, you can go over to um, that other video. This is Eckhart Tolle's sequel to The Power of Now, A New Earth, where he discusses what Earth would be like if everyone adopted the ideas from The Power of Now. And here we have three wonderful classics, all a little bit lengthy, so it could take a while to work through these. But we have Yuval Noah Harari's three publications, Sapiens, 
Homo Deus and 21 Lessons for the 21st Century. All very fascinating and thought-provoking. And yeah, if, if they are chosen, I, what I'll do is I'll read for a couple of hours each night until the book is finished. Next, we have Ted Chang's Stories of Your Life and Others, which I read just recently at the live read we did the other day. I read his um, The Tower of Babylon. So there's many other short stories in there if you're interested. Next, we have H.G. Wells' is, um, The Country of the Blind and other selected stories. So H.G. Wells also has many uh, different and, and many and diverse short stories. Next, we move on to a deep and meaningful, it's not a story, this is non-fiction, Viktor Frankl's Man's Search for Ultimate Meaning. So within all of these books, there's some fiction and some non-fiction so it's whatever you guys like you just have to let me know and be sure to comment next we have P. D. Spensky's uh, novel The Strange Life of Ivan Osakin which I'm just very interested to read so if you are too let me know in the comments next we have The Lessons of History by Will and Ariel Durant so that's just uh, some very interesting stories from history Next, we come on to Nietzsche's fa famous book, Thus Spake Zarathustra. So that could be a bit heavy, but again, here at Book Club, we're up for anything. If you're interested in that, let me know. Next, two very famous, or the next three, really, are very famous stories. We have Stevenson's The Strange Case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, real classic. We have, um, is it Jonathan Swift? Jona Jonathan Swift's Gulliver's Travels. Paolo Coelho's The Alchemist. Jules Verne, Around the World in 80 Days. And Daniel Defoe's Robinson Crusoe. So all of those fives are real absolute gems and classics. So you have to let me know if any of those are interesting for you. And let me know in the comments. Next we have um, Junichiro... Tanizaki and Praise of Shadows, which I'm, I've never read, but could be quite interesting. Another famous one, Cahil Gibran's The Prophet. Uh, the next two you can learn more about in the books of introduction to spirituality. We have Don Miguel Ruiz's The Four Agreements, Deepak Chopra's The Seven Spiritual Laws of Success. This one in between another three from the books of introduction to spirituality uh is it robert robert perzig zen and the art of motorcycle maintenance another very interesting and and wonderful classic these next three you can find out more about on books of introduction to spirituality we have the power of positive thinking the power of your subconscious mind and the celestine prophecy next we have Sophie's World by Josephine Gardner, or Gardner, sorry. This is a really wonderful story about Sophie and her interactions with a mystical philosophy teacher. Next, we move on to another classic, Chuck Falanick's Fight Club. We have Emily Bronte's Wuthering Heights, Jack Kerouac's On the Road, Alexander Solzhenitsyn, One Day in the Life of Ivan Denisovich. Probably a, a bit deep, not really a nice fun story, but like I say here at Book Club, we've got a lot to um we've got a lot to read and to get on with. Anthony Burgess, A Clockwork Orange, um Wu Ch Wu Cheng En, Monkey, a classic um, spiritual story of a mystical monkey, Herman Hesse's Steppenwolf, Carlos Castaneda's Journey to Ixlan, and Miguel Cervantes' Don Quixote. So here we have a very wide and diverse range of books for you, and you must let me know in the comments which one you'd like to see so I can bring it to the poll. So they are all of the books available within the pool for you to comment on below and let me know which one you would most like to see me read live on the uh, live reads at the channel. And don't forget to go and check out the other two 
the most important one really is the Raul Dahl's recommendations from Matilda because the introductory books of spirituality, many of them are here. So yeah, guys, this is the beginning, the first community poll. Please get involved, share it around with your friends and family who also might be interested in participating and getting their book um, into a live read and then so that you can all come and join me and like I mentioned once before and I'll say it again I'd like nothing more than for you to comment for it to get into a poll for it to win the poll and then to be able to interact for you to be able to make the live read and then for you to come and say hello and uh, yeah hear me listening reading it live so very exciting this is ultimately a way for me to bring the most popular books of the moment that people want to see to the live reads and that's what I do across all my channels so yeah thanks for staying to the end and watching this don't forget to comment which book you would most like to see come to the live reads and in a few days time you will see the first poll here at book club be sure to vote and again share that around and spread the word spread the message because I'm going to keep reading whether there's zero people or a hundred people, it makes no difference to me. I'm just going to keep doing my live reads and growing the channel. But yeah, it would be lovely to have more people to come and share and enjoy. So guys, take care. Don't forget to comment and I'll see you soon.